And welcome back, this is Baluscuba with more Let's Play Sword of Mana. I'm joined as always by Loki. Misa is back with us because, well, she is our best companion, plus the, the, the plot doesn't really give us much of a choice. I've been doing a lot of level grinding, and by a lot I mean enough to get to this point, and I have a lot more to do. What I have been doing is I have been getting uh, upgrades for all of my spirits. If you were hoping for more plot today, once again, you have hit the wrong video. We're doing side quests for a while. I have three of each spirit, so I got one by purchasing uh, another spirit from the Lady in Ish at night for three dud bears gold, and I got one uh, from turning in the geodes that we've been picking up along the way. So everybody has three of themselves hanging out. I don't know where, but they're hanging out all together. Now, we are going to get the fourth upgrade for each of these spirits. How do we do this? We need to do it by saving the game, believe it or not. Once you have three of each spirit, well, once you have three of the spirit in question and you pray to the goddess statue at a certain area, we're out right outside the Batmo cave where we pretty much started the game. And if I pray to the guy's statue here, here are my two save files. I have not saved for a while. Let's go ahead and save down here. I'm level 55, by the way. I'll, I'll show you the level up for 56 since it's rather important. But once we have saved, the whole screen flickers. And is that a wisp? I'm Wisp, a light spirit. They all have the same name, apparently. I want to go with you guys. Yes. Thanks a bundle, and we've received another wisp, a light spirit. Now this is incredibly random, I must say. You have to pray at this statue during the day. It doesn't matter which day, but it does matter what time of day. And now we have four wisps with, with us. Now I'll just meet you at the next location, since they are, as you might expect, all across the map. Now we're back in the town of Ish, and it is night. Any guesses as to what we could get here during the night? How do you know it's night? She's still there. But we're done with you. We pu we purchased everything that I could possibly want. I am out of Dud Bear's Gold. We need to pray to this goddess statue right here. We're just going to overwrite the same file here. Just keep on doing it. Because... Who is it going to be? We have another... Spirit, it is Shade. Once again, I am Shade, a dark spirit. Can I be of assistance? Uh, you can say no. Uh, you just have to do it again. Like, there's no penalty for saying no, other than you don't get them at that time. At your service. And we've received another Shade, which gives us four total Shades. Time to get another one. And now we're outside the town of Jaw, just slightly to the north, and we have another Mana Goddess statue. I still haven't gotten that level up. As soon as I do, I will show it off, because it is an important one. And by saving at night out here, we can get ourselves another spirit. It's a Luna spirit this time. You know what? I'm Luna, a moon spirit. Yes, I already have three of you. I know how this works. Yes, I will take you, other moon spirit. Thanks, bunches, and we receive Luna, our fourth moon spirit. Now, we will be getting more, and more, and more! And we're outside, on the path to Gaia. Gaia Cave is over to the left, and the abandoned mine is to our right. I had to travel from uh, Wendell in order to get here. And during the day, we can pray to the Man of Goddess statue. Once again, we're just overriding the same file here. And we get another spirit. As you might imagine, why would I be showing you this if we didn't get a spirit? This time, it's Salamander again. It's me, Salamander, a fire spirit. I'll show you what I can do. Yes, show me what you can do. And that marks uh, the halfway point. We have four of the eight spirits that we are looking for for this quest. 
And now we are just a little bit south of Vinquette Hall on the path to Vinquette. Sorry, the, the Vinquette vicinity, which is still a very strange name. Uh, we need to pray to the goddess statue here during the day. I believe the morning would work as well. And we get ourselves yet another spirit. Who's it going to be this time? It's Jin. How are you doing, Jin? How goes it? I'm Jin, a wins. Spirit, that's right, he's got the, the lisp. I'm so spirited, I'll even come along on your journey. Sure, join up, a smart choice. We've received Jin a wind spirit. Hooray! Five down, three more to go, once again, just for this quest. And now we've made it to probably my least favorite statue to try to get to. This is back in the marsh cave, right before the boss fight. I hope it is the right time of day. I can't really tell. I need it to be uh, morning or day for this. Please, please be the right time of day. Now I just need to save the once. I'm not sure if you actually do need to save, to be honest with you. You could probably just go in and cancel out. But... For this, you can get Undyne, a water spirit. I'll gladly help you in any way I can. Sure. A rigatoni? Really? A rigatoni? Just, just the one? What kind of sauce does it have? And she has joined our party. Just two more to go. Once again, just for this one. Much more to come later. And we're at the second hardest to find statue. This statue is outside of Cascade Cave, which is right over here. This is the path to Mount Elusia, where all the uh, giant Easter head Moai faces were that we had to change the expressions of. We need to be here at night. We need to pray to the goddess statue. And that should be done right there. And we have another spirit, of course. This time it's... Oh, it's you. You are a wood spirit. I will. I r could you take me with you? Yes, yes I could. Sure. You're very happy. I'll do my best. Receive Dryad, a wood spirit. Hooray! And there was only one pun in there and they didn't even emphasize it, which is kind of nice. Just one more to go. This one's a lot easier, too. And we're back in the town of Ish. And it is during the day. We are going to pray to this statue right here. This statue again? This statue again. Why this statue again? I don't I don't know. But this statue again will get us the eighth and final upgrade we are looking for. Gnome, of course. You know, you and Moti kind of do the same dance. I'm, I'm just saying, no, I'm just saying, it's me, I'm Gnome in our spirit. Okay, if I tag along with all of you, of course, Gnome, the obvious choice. Receive Gnome in Earth spirit. Now, once again, you can only do this if you have three spirits of each spirit. Uh, well, not necessarily of every spirit, but three of the one that you're trying to get. You have to pray to, to these statues. Not necessarily in this order, but at this time of the day. Now, that should give us four of every spirit. Hooray, it does. Now it's time to try to get a fifth. Are you ready? Of course not. I am, though. And now that we have three upgrades, four total spirits for everything, we have more random screens to go to at random times. As you might see here, it is during the night on Gnome Day, which means that the next screen that I go to will make it Man Holy Day. We are just outside of Topple, just outside of the Cascade Cottage, which is our next destination. In order for this to happen, though, you not only need four spirits of the given spirit that we are looking for, you also need the ten trait coins. Now, if you have been level grinding to get ten coins of everything like I have, you want to do this quest first before you turn it into the guy that we visited previously. Uh, this quest will not consume the, the, the coins uh, 
not the white coins, not any of the coins. It won't consume any of them. However, uh, the guy uh, up north in the uh, the Malaris cave, he will take your coins. So you want to do this one first, unless you want to get 20 of each of them. And trust me, getting 10 is enough. I'll post in the uh, video description uh, some of the locations if you are interested in farming for the coins. With all that said and done, it is time to move on. Let's go to the left. And over here, as soon as we get on the screen in front of Cascade Cottage, another spirit shows up. It is Wisp. This time you actually have to walk up and, and talk to Wisp. How, how you doing? I'm Wisp. I'm a white spirit. Light spirit. Not, not white. Light. I want to go with you guys. You can say no. I wouldn't suggest it. I will say yes. Thanks a bundle. And we get our fifth Wisp spirit we are really racking in the spirits aren't we and just to, oh i can't prove it here i can prove that we got five though i can prove that we got five spirits as you saw there five with spirits now i have to wait in order for the enemies to load on the screen there we go now i can show you that you do in fact keep all your coins which is the most important part i'll meet you at the next screen where we can get another spirit now we are back in the town of Wendell. Once again, the day is very important. I don't know if I emphasized that enough when we got Wisp. It has to be Mana Holy Day. Uh, for this one, not only does it have to be Mana Holy Day, it has to be night during Mana Holy Day. And we're in the town of Wendell, where I can head up north here and make it to the cathedral. Where, what do you guess? We, we have another spirit. We have Shade again. We have another Shade. How you doing? I'm Shade, the Dog Spirit. Can I be of uh, any assistance? Sure you can. It's your service. And we get our fifth Shade Spirit. Very nice. Very, very nice indeed. We're still in the town of Wendell, believe it or not, this time. It is Luna Day, which kind of gives away what spirit we're going to be getting here. Uh, I don't think the time of the day matters. We need to go into the inn, into where Devious was hanging out when we first met him. And here, we get another Luna spirit way over there in the corner. Why you make me run all the way over here to talk to you, spirit? You know what? I'm Luna, Moon Spirit. Take me with you. Sure. Why not? Thanks, bunches. And we get our third spirit for this side quest. Uh, now, I should mention for these uh, upgrade quests, you only really need to get one of the spirits in order to complete the quest. However, I'm going for all eight. I'll meet you at the next one.